my dad bought this big goal and put towels on the top bins and we just to just curl it in out the back. Oh, he's jinking through. This is incredible! Johnny Voss with a masterful solo goal! My football journey started here at Hobbs Crossing Soccer Club when I was about five years old. Back then it was just once a week with some of the lads and then that went on to on the nines, on the tens and that's where I started loving the ball. So moved on to Point Cook after that for a couple of years and to the state team and ended up at Melbourne City Academy and just worked through the ranks there. Uh, my first coaches were actually uh, my dad. He, he, was, he was the hardest one of them all to be honest, but he was, he was a good coach, he knew what he was talking about. He used to play in the day as well, so he just pushed me here at the club and at home as well. So I couldn't, couldn't get away from him. Does he still get stuck into you? Uh, not as much, not, not as much as... Mm, actually, wait, do you? No. <laughs> no, you, no, you didn't do that. You didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, we uh, also used to juggle a lot on the street with my younger brother, Casey. When I'm playing in the game, playing how I play, I think it's just uh, innately from when I played when I was younger and it's just instinctive now because of all those trainings back then. But when I was smaller, I always used to be a lot shorter and a lot smaller than all the other boys. So I think me growing up and getting a bit bigger has uh, helped me. Great touch from Boss, and it's in for our goal. Plenty of holding on, driven back in, and it's a first A-League men's goal for the left back, Jordan Boss. So far, Playing for the, the first team at Melbourne City, a bit of a bit of a roller coaster. The, my first game, don't even want to think about it. it. Might have cost us a goal, but I think I've turned it on a little bit. But yeah, there's always ups and downs when you're playing professional or just soccer in general or any sport. To be fair, so just have to uh, get back to it and pick yourself back up. I had uh, two idols when I was younger, both Messi and Robin. Yeah, I used to base a lot of my game on them too, uh, when I played midfield and right winger. And I, I always liked how Robin cut in and uh, just banged at top ends. And just recently when I started playing left back, uh, Alfonso Davies, uh, I liked how he played, so I tried to base my, myself off him as well. Playing here at Hobbes Crossing acted as a stepping stone to where I am now. Hopefully uh, in the next couple of years, I go overseas, That's that's, my dream, so hopefully I keep pushing and keep uh, proving myself and maybe get a call one day and head over there.